Hi and welcome to this new video. Uh, I'm Lou from terrorparlor.com and I wanted to talk to you today about this guy, the old English tarot. I get a lot of questions about this deck because I use it a lot on my blog and on Instagram. Um, and you can find the links to those in the description below. Um, yeah, people just always ask me about this deck and I get it. It's it's really, really good. Um, I use it a lot for readings with clients. It's one of those more serious um, decks, you know, kind of like my old Italian deck and my Marseille deck, things like that. And that's actually why I really like this this deck. Um, I'm gonna take it out of the box. You can see the box has been, you know, it's had a rough life. <laughs> There's lots of tape and whatnot. Um, oh, look at this. Didn't plan for it. <laughs> see, I really, really love this deck because it really is by far the most accurate deck that I've ever had. Um, I can read tarot with, well, basically any deck, really. Um, I know how to create a connection with decks. But this, this one here, I don't even need to prepare. I swear I could just be on the train, think about something else, and just ask a random question about me or something, whatever, and it will be 100% accurate every time. It's insane. Um, also, one thing that I really love about it, I'm just gonna show you some cards. One thing that I really, really love about this deck is that it's a really good mix of Marseille, you know, the imagery and the style is just, it's, it's just very, very simple and very faithful to the very original Marseille and Italian decks. But it also, so if you look at the Major Arcana, for instance, you see that's very, very classic, very classic, very easy to read, very consistent, you know, it's just the things that we're used to from books, you know, and that I'm used to from my tradition, which is the Marseille tradition. So I personally appreciate that. Um, obviously, we're all different. So there you go, but there you go. It's also a little bit of a mix of Marseille and RWS when it comes to the minor arcana. So really any card you can see, like on the Marseille deck, you mainly have just what it is. So this is the seven of swords, you have seven swords, easy, right? But just like in the RWS, you actually have a little bit more. You have something that tells a little bit of a story that can help you, especially, I know a lot of beginners like RWS better because the minor, the, the minor, sorry, the minor arcana is easier to read. Um, so you kind of have the best of both worlds with this deck. And it is an English deck. And, you know, so it's based off Marseille, but it's obviously influenced by RWS as well, you know. But the style is just, you know, it's kind of medieval a little bit, you know, that's what it's trying to be at least, um, which which is a good vibe. <laughs> Look at this card trying to come out here. Oh, a really, really good card. So anyway, I think you get an idea of, you know, the style and, and what it feels like. And like I said, it's just, it's really easy to read. It's really easy to approach. Um, it's perfect for beginners because it will help you learn the symbolism of tarot and you can basically use any traditional book, you know, and just dive in and you won't have any weird stuff going on. Some people like the weird stuff. There's nothing wrong with it, obviously, you know, but if you just want to start with the basics, but also have something that's just a little bit different, you know, this is your guy. And like I said... I have never, ever, ever had, let's come back, let's get back to the sun here. I have never, ever had a prediction or a reading that was not 100% accurate with this deck. So, highly recommend. It's very easy to find on that, you know, big website where you can buy everything. Um, or in your bookshop, maybe. I don't know. So, super easy to find, super easy to read, and I highly recommend it. The Old English Tarot, 
yeah, let me know if you're using it. Let me know what you think of it. You know, I would love to hear your thoughts in the comment section. Thank you. Bye.